to Steve and we are talking jewelry. Hi Steve, thanks for having us today. Hi, thanks for showing up. Okay, so <laughs> kind of go some, over some of the jewelry with us. What are the newest trends? All right, some of the newest trends this season are definitely going towards still white gold as we all know. Okay. Yellow gold starting to come back in slightly, um, but the biggest trends of the season are definitely going to be the new colors, which not to be unexpected. It's going to be pink. Um, pink. Love pink. Really <laughs> still, still a hot color. Uh, orange was last season, but it's still going strong. Okay. Uh, that'll probably go strong through fall, and then I think it's going to be more of a darker burgundy. Okay. Um, as far as shapes, um, the heart has made a revival. Okay. So the heart's going to be a great shape for everything. You're going to see it in a lot more of rings. Um, Necklaces, not so much earrings. Okay. Oh, yeah. And that's great for Valentine's yeah, Day. And you, you know, or any time, really. Yeah, absolutely. But and, love and we saw some different shapes, too, in, in some of the hearts. Right. And the heart's going to be a lot more asymmetrical, not so much swirly as you would expect, as we've seen in the past. Okay. Um, yeah, and you have something on here. Yeah, just more of a, a leaning shapes, uh, very clean, uh, symmetrical. Some interlocking. There are interlocking some hearts. very beautiful. Yeah, that's my favorite one I've seen so far. Great. Yeah, and this one has a set. What is the name of this? The interlocking hearts. Is it the necklace with the bracelet? Oh, the name of it. The brand name is Hearts on Fire. Hearts on Fire. Okay. Um, yep. They make all their jewelry in 18 karat gold, so it's a little bit higher purity than we expected with the uh, 14 karat. Great. And then this was your favorite, Corey. You I love, love that this. on this. Yeah. It's really yeah, this pretty. This is great. It's a lariat, so it's really great to wear over a sweater um, or, you know, with a, a high button-up blouse. And that's neat. It gives you some different choices with a different neckline. Mm -hmm. And I like gold. So I'm a fan of gold. You so. are. Definitely. Uh, what, what about the one I have on? Uh, the one that you have on is a 14 karat, obviously, diamond and garnet. Um, Very pretty. Obviously, like what I just said, <laughs> yeah. is you liked it, and it's, <laughs> it's that darker burgundy that's going to be coming this style later this season. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely different color and mm -hmm. def really fun. We have some other neat gifts that would be really easy to give for uh, different holidays, different, and I think just for anybody. We were saying daughters and you know a lot of different fun oh, things. Yeah. It Can obviously, you tell us about this line? like this, this is the Santo Milano. Mm -hmm. It's Italian inspired. And it really opens up because it opens into a nice price point. These pieces start at probably seventy dollars and up. Okay, well, that's great. Um, that's good. Yep, they're uh, they're made in uh, Europe, and they're imported into America. And they use everything which is a natural, you know, natural colors. They lab create wonderful all their stones and everything. Well, it's gorgeous. Yep. We love yeah. it. And now we're going to take a, a look at a few of uh, some men's pieces as well. All right. Okay. All right, Steve, well, we don't want to leave out the men, so tell us a little about the watches that you have here. Well, you're right. The men is normally the most unrepresented person in the jewelry store. <laughs> that is very true. <laughs> they have a small section over here. Yeah, but coming across <laughs> this, it's, you know, it's pretty easy. The, um, the men's wedding band has kind of morphed from just being just a plain gold wedding band to we get something a little bit more our style, which is tungsten carbide, which is like an indestructible metal. Um, that it's important. It's very important. That it is. A lot yeah. of men don't even wear their wedding bands because they're worried about destroying them. So this kind of takes that out and gives them no excuse not to wear the wedding band now. There you go. I like that. Yeah. Everybody likes that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you have many different styles and you can get Love the tungsten these. with gold in it or silver highlights. You can get it with a carbon fill or just nice, plain, indestructible Very tungsten. nice. Those are great. Those are nice. Okay. And then we have some great watches here. Yeah. Now, so one of those popular ones, and they're the king of the mid-range is Citizen. Mm -hmm. Citizen has a great echo drive movement. What that means is that it's powered by light, sunlight's mm -hmm. always the best, um, it can't stop working unless you leave it in the darkness for more than six months. Um, but a couple of things, now because they never stop working, Citizen has a perpetual calendar, which means that it will go forever and never be wrong on the day or the date. It will wow. even adjust itself through leap years. Oh, that is that so is interesting. amazing. I love that. Yeah, and That's guys great. like low maintenance. Uh, yes, that is very true. Except in the women. I was just going to say that, but I decided to bite my tongue. <laughs> you know, all the right things to say, right. Steve. And then to go even more low maintenance, um, they even have an atomic watch, which is very similar in all the other ways to the perpetual calendar, except that it updates itself at 3 o'clock in the morning with the Colorado world clock wirelessly, so it's always correct. And then we have a few bracelets and... Yeah, a few bracelets and the bigger ones. And what's nice is with the gold prices coming down, these big bracelets are making a reoccurrence. All right. 
Thanks for showing us around. I My think pleasure. There was a lot of beautiful things that we're going to want to try on the rest of the day. Yes. And for more information on where to find you, where can we find you? Uh, LeoMarksJewelers.com. Okay. And we also have a Facebook, which is very active. Okay. Uh, great. Well, we'll definitely look on those pages and, and show all of our viewers where to find those as well.